Welcome to your Weather on Demand. I'm meteorologist Wesley Williams from UpperMichiganSource.com. We had some rainfall around the area yesterday. Here's a look at the totals. Most of the rain fell right here at Iron River. They recorded an inch and four tenths of rainfall there. And it looks like the least, well, right around the Keebanaw Copper Harbor didn't record any rain. About a half inch at Waters Meet as well as Watton and Marquette. Only two tenths at Munising and only one tenth nearly um, at Iron Mountain. This brings our rainfall totals for the month up above normal finally but we're still below normal for the whole season so far and that probably is because we saw a little bit less than normal snow last month here's a look at the uh, situation we've got going on clouds around most of the Great Lakes and Midwest rain showers down to our south it's all thanks to low pressure sent to our north and west in Canada stretching a large low pressure trough across much of the country. And we are seeing high pressure out to the west, starting to ridge on through in, in between that low pressure, kind of like a dry slot. And so what that'll do for our forecast today is kind of break apart that precipitation for us. And we'll see only a slight chance of rain showers today with some sunshine possible by the afternoon and evening. And then tomorrow looks like we'll be on the backside of that system. Rain showers possible in your forecast, but also colder air brought on by northerly winds. Here's a look at that with a forecast model. We got clouds around this morning, but watch the clearing come in from the west. Thanks to that dry air, some sunshine is possible in the western UP. And then it spreads further eastward over the course of the evening into tonight. But it's short lived. More clouds move through by tomorrow, bringing that chance of showers into your Tuesday forecast. But then after that, a big area of high pressure dries us out for a while. Here's a look at today's temperatures. If you're in the east, staying in the 50s all day. In the west, could get up into the 60s. That's the model picking up on that possible sunshine by this evening. Otherwise, just look for a slight chance of rain showers with mostly to partly cloudy skies today. Then tonight, we're looking for a low around 40 degrees with partly cloudy skies in the west turning mostly cloudy in the east. Could see more fog develop overnight. A look at the TV six day forecast. We've got 60 for a high tomorrow with rain showers, then really sunny by Wednesday, but also cooling back into the 50s before rebounding on those temperatures towards the end of the week. Looks like we end on a sunny and a warm note by Friday.